What's up, bros? Now, right here in front of me, we have a LEGO Wolverine minifigure that I own. It's strictly a display piece. The torso is cracked, the head has scratches, and the cowl has a bunch of dents. Now, let's put this minifigure together. So, basically, what I'm going to be doing here is I'm going to be upgrading the claws of this LEGO Wolverine minifigure. As we all know, the claws that are used for LEGO Wolverine minifigures are just simple. They can be attached into the hands of a LEGO minifigure or specifically Wolverine. But this technically isn't accurate, so that's why I want to take the claw piece, cut off the hand attachment piece, and then glue the claws to the front or the side of the hand to make it look like the official Wolverine claw look. So I went to Home Depot to get some super glue specifically to make this modification. And I specifically got super glue that can be used on most plastics, so it's totally safe to use for LEGO. And some other stuff that I'm going to be using are sandpaper and some nail clippers. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take the nail clipper and cut off the handheld part of the claws. And as you can see here, this is the final product. We can compare that to the unmodified version of the claws. Then do the same for the other side. Then I'm going to put both of these claws on the sandpaper and smooth them out a little bit. And now that we're done with that, the claws are almost complete. So what I gotta do now is I'm gonna have to glue them to the sides of the yellow Wolverine hands. I'm gonna remove the arms and the hands from the Wolverine minifigure and attach them to some broken pieces. So just in case the glue gets a little messy, it doesn't end up on like the rest of the Wolverine minifigure. Now let's get down to business. And once we got one side done, we can do the other, pop that onto the hand, make sure it's in the correct position and in the same position as the other claw on the other hand. And then we wait. One hour later. And after an hour of waiting, we can attach the arms with the modified claws to the Wolverine minifigure. And doesn't that look amazing? If we can take a closer look, some of the glue turns white when it gets hard, so that is an issue. And if you take a closer look at the hands, you can see a bit of the white glue on the side. But other than that, I think the claws or the modification itself turned out pretty good. So this is just a very easy and simple modification that you can do to your Wolverine minifigures. All you gotta do is sacrifice some claws and a pair of hands and then you can just, you know, cut them up, glue them, and then you have an upgraded or modified LEGO Wolverine minifigure. This isn't a purist modification, but it's still a good one. Anyway, I hope you bros enjoyed this video. I'm going to be doing more non-purist modifications for LEGO minifigures in the near future, depending on if this video does well. But anyway, feel free to check out my other videos. I mostly make custom minifigures. Have a great day. See you bros.